Hello everyone and welcome. Today's picture is, it's basically two pictures in one. I drew Farina from Genshin Impact and I made the first drawing, which I did in, I guess it was 2000, the end of 2023, I almost said 2013, uh, the end of 2023. And then in 2024, I was like, I could do better. So I went back over it and changed it again. So we'll kind of speed through like the first one because we'll just kind of pretend that that's like the draft. But you can see here, I was adding more details for Farina. I was trying out different ideas for like how to do the eyes and stuff. Um, drew the shape of the face there. Drew all the line art, the little curls in her hair. So yeah, this would have been the end of 2023 because that's when she came out. Started adding the colors working on the eyes it, it felt like it was a little too um i don't know so somewhere around here yeah i had like like little sparkle things to her hair yep it says right there kev 2023 uh yep so i took there we go i took this this was the end of the first picture and then i removed all the color and I used it as like the draft for the next one. So I removed all the color. I repositioned it, gave myself more room because I thought it was a little too zoomed in. I wanted to add a bit more. So I started adding more to the rest of her hair, working on reshaping the face, reshaping the eyes, uh, drawing more detail up there on her hat and then adding more to like her clothes there. So I, I thought it was a little too zoomed in. I wanted to like kind of thin it out too. I went through, then I started doing the line art there. I, oh yeah, I forgot all about this. I wanted to see what it would look like if I just did harsh, like, uh, is it harsh shading or just hard shading? Whatever it is, I just wanted to make it where it was like pure black for the shading. Because I felt like that makes it kind of pop a little bit better. I don't know if I kept that in the end design or not. Oh yeah, and I was just trying to make it all gray and stuff too just to see where I was gonna color things. Here I started with the different, like the darker color. Like like I said with the, um, what was it? The the emote, the Kev Tendo little emote one is I wanted to start off with the darker color and work towards lightening it up. I, I, I think that looks nice. Um, then I started coloring it in. The eyes, I feel like it's a little too saturated here. I'm not sure if I fix that later on or if I just see it, it looks okay with the rest of the hair. But yeah, I was trying to, I guess that's grayscale. You know, starting with like grays and then adding color to it after. Just to see like where the shading goes. And then I could just work on the colors later. Well, I mean, I guess her hair is pretty bright. That was the other thing was the hair is very blue on the last picture. And here I wanted to make it like whitish gray and light blue. Oh, I, I guess I didn't keep the dark color. I guess that looks fine too. Uh, let's see, finished off the hat, adding more streaks to the hair, adding like the, the, <laughs> uh, what do I, the eye shinies, that's what I call it. <laughs> what else do we have here? Uh, okay, I don't know what that thing is, that like little fluff part that's on her shirt, and then I drew that little like gemstone that's there, that wasn't on there before. Then I started working on like the shading and the folds. What would I do there? Oh, okay. So here I was trying to see if I could make her cheeks look more flushed. If I just drew some like, like, like a pink, a pink splotch. And then there is, I can just show it later. There's a little filter option or whatever that you can do on, on procreate where like you can do a, a, a blur effect and it just kind of spreads out the color. So I did that to try and make her face look a little more flushed. And we went through, added the highlights. Now this part here, where you see where it just shows her eyes, I was trying to work out making her hair look like, uh, or at least like making the eyes transparent or like kind of clip with the hair. So I had to separate the eyes. Yeah, like right there. I was testing the different options that they have to see like how the hair would look over the, over the, uh, over the eye. So then at this point, I took the line art because I wanted to see what it would look like if I left the line art black or if I made a separate layer on top of it and then started adding like the, um, I don't know what to call it, but I basically changed the, the line art to like, 
you know, a purple or color or something to make it like not as as harsh of a color. Um, then we go through here, add just some extra stuff there. And you can see down here, uh, Keptendo 2024. So yeah, it was 2024 when I went and basically redrew the whole picture. So yep, there's my Farina picture. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys next time. Bye everyone.